Bermuda has been magnificent on more fronts than one. The main selling point and moment that I relish in has been the connections from a friendship perspective of like-minded, talented, ambitious and driven young folks and to spend a month together has been exhilarating and rejuvenating for the soul. From this trip, I'm taking away a love for such amazing people. I'm taking away an incredible passion for what I do. I'm taking away the idea that you can literally live wherever you want and you don't have to necessarily feel planted in a city or in a space. You can travel and do what you love. It just provides so much opportunity and so much inspiration for so many. It was really interesting to see people from, from different regions, different homes, um, and also different industries of, of business as well. And so personally, I'm looking forward to taking that diversity of thought and experience back with me, being able to consider uh, perspectives from a different lens and, and hopefully apply that going forward from a business and personal capacity. The mentorship program was phenomenal. It was really a give and take between my mentee and I, whose business focused on event planning, major event planning all across the island. We shared ideas about both of our businesses and we bounced our most radical ideas off of each other. And he gave me a kind of hometown, small town feel of how do I make things more intimate, more personal. And I kind of gave him, hey, what if we thought about going global? What if you thought about off the island? And here are some tools that we're using in the US or in Europe that could help accelerate your business. My mentee, Ray, does 1616 cocktails, and it is a viral product here in Bermuda. Everyone loves it, and I actually feel that instead of me uh, supporting her a lot, I think she has been like really amazing in teaching me about like her ways in like pushing out this product and making it into what it is today. It has been a really great relationship, and I especially love it with like the showcase where like everything came together she was able to pitch to this like great audience and like everyone was like crying laughing and clapping and she got a hug from the premiere i think it was a lovely experience last week we had an event hosted by bacardi it was fun and but it was also educational it was really Awesome to hear about how they thought about growing uh, their business as a family-owned business. I believe they are the largest family-owned liquor distributor in the world. And uh, I was lucky enough to sit next to the VP of Finance at Bacardi. We compared notes and talked about my company is at a much earlier stage than Bacardi. They've been around, it sounds like, for nearly two centuries. We've been around maybe about six years. It was just very exciting having these conversations. My favorite moment was probably the PowerPoint night. I mean, we had a few of these, but what was special about that is people could talk about anything that they were passionate about, not necessarily work or something that you know got them on the Forbes list, but just something they loved and were deeply passionate about. And that really made you get to know people a lot better. I think one of the things I've enjoyed the most is seeing people like do what they do. So for example, we had Kat who does photo shoots, so black and white photo shoots, we did that. And then we also had Liam who makes sauces, and then we ate the sauces together. And I thought it was just really fun to see people come together and like show you know, what they've built their life doing. For me, specifically, was our fashion show. We put together a fashion show really, really fast. I have a clothing brand, of course, and was able to ship off some clothes from the U.S. here. It got here literally, like, one day before our event, and we were able to do the fittings for models, which were our other residency members. We were able to do the fitting the day of the fashion show, and everything worked out beautifully. On the final day of the trip, we actually went on a catamaran tour and what was actually really amazing about that is that everybody was just so relaxed and just willing to, to live their lives, be their best selves and ultimately just, just get to know people on a really personal level. It wasn't necessarily about business, it wasn't necessarily about personal life, it was just organic. I think that Bermuda is very innovative in a lot of different ways and I think that a lot of that comes from kind of understanding the circumstances of their island, kind of what their needs are, what their lacks are, but also what they're abundant in and really using that to their advantage. So I really love to see the innovation on this island and what they do in terms of uh, recycling and capturing water and even the way that they take care of their island together as a community. 
Speaking from an energy perspective, which I do from clean technology, I've learned a lot about the, like the Bermudan power grid. I had some opportunities to meet with various locals that are into renewable energy, the, the CEO of the, the power company and others. So learning about the energy mix here and actually what, what I do in my day job and how it might be able to help the island move towards sustainable energy has been uh, you know, really interesting to me and not something I would have necessarily expected to have done whilst I was out here. I think what I take away from this trip is that even though people are working on a lot of different things in vastly different industries, we also have a lot of the same challenges and uh, opportunities to pursue. And if you talk openly about what some of those are in your case, there's many ways that you can both get help and give help to others in the group. If you're ever on the fence about whether to come to this residency, I would say go for it. A hundred percent, you will not regret it. People who came later and didn't spend a full month actually wish they came earlier. So there's not been a single person who's been like, you know, I wish I didn't come here in Bermuda for a month. I was very hesitant. I didn't think it was going to work out. I was like, oh, am I going to spend that much money? Like, what is it that's going to really happen there? Honestly, this has been life changing. I feel like this month feels like it's been so long because it's been full of new opportunities and new people. And I feel like I'm going back home with a new sense of self, with a new direction even for my business and for my team.